Hi guys and welcome to the channel. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make your phone look aesthetic, aesthetic, aesthetically pleasing in a minimalist way. I don't know what to title this video but yeah let's do this. So the first thing you want to do is clear out all the apps on your phone. By the way I pre-downloaded my wallpaper from Pinterest and I'll leave a link in the description down below for you to get them. So I am currently removing all of the apps from my own screen and making it a clean slate for me to work with. This would be another cool way or an easy way for you to clear out apps you are no longer using and also declutter. I also did this. So all of the apps are in your app library and the first app we are going to be working with is called Widget Smith. It is available on the Play Store and I have already saved up some pictures based on my taste prior to this time. But now I am going to select a picture that I'm going to have on my home screen and I already have pictures in my Pinterest folder and I think I'm going to work with this one from Banana Fish. Looks pretty okay. I also chose the small widget to work with. So going back to my own screen, I'm just going to tap on the screen and then tap on the plus button. Go down to widget smith. Pick small widget and add that to home screen. When you tap on it, you would see um, it's still loading, but you would see the particular picture that is going to come up based on the name of the picture or the widget and you save it and there we go you started building your minimalist aesthetic home screen <laughs> right now you go to an app called shortcuts now we're going to start designing the apps we're going to have on our home screen so we're going to start with tapping on the plus button going to add action and tapping on scripting and not apps tap on scripting you tap on open app you choose the app you want to go with i decided to go with instagram i really didn't know what apps start with i decided to go with instagram tap on the three icons there tap on home screen tap on the icon then you choose your picture i pre-downloaded pictures from pinterest already i was recently into the beige aesthetics but now i'm into the black and white aesthetics and i'm going to tap on instagram and choose this picture i'm going to change the name from new shortcut 2 to instagram there we go and you've added it to your home screen it's super duper easy and you can edit it to however you like on your home screen and let's do it again but this time i'm going to be doing it with snapchat in fast mode just just because i can i'm just going to show you once again how this works and how easy it is although it may be time consuming but if you take your time when you have free time or oh, i did this in traffic when i first discovered this and it was super duper easy and satisfying to do and my home screen looked 10 times better than it did before So I'm going to add one more app to my home screen and the name of this app is called Minimalist and you could pick between small, medium to large widget but I'm going with small widget and this is a to-do list app that keeps on reminding me of the tasks I need to do later on in the future which is pretty okay. I'm taking away the widget smith. I don't think I need that for my own page. And the second app we are going to work with is called Zen Flip Clock. Zen Flip Clock is a time and calendar app and I'm just going to add this to my home screen to you know always remind me of the time and also the dates of the month. It just looks really cool for your home screen. So I'm going to just rearrange the apps on my home screen and just make it look how I want it to look or how satisfied I am. And this is the finished product. It's really simple to do and also I would advise for you to put only apps that you use frequently in your own page and it will just be super duper easy and minimalist for you to use. So I hope you enjoy this aesthetic 
video and let me know your thoughts in the comment section if you're going to try this and i'll see you in my next video all right bye